Mitra, I'm South Indian and I hate how every South Indian issue becomes just a South Indian issue because we don't talk about it in English. So this video is in English and it is to explain in graphic detail what happened to Jairaj and his son Phoenix during this past one week in a town in my state called Tutukudi or Tutikoran. This treatment cannot be meted out even to serial killers and these two gentlemen were completely innocent and this is what the police did to them. This happened in Tutikoran. First, their knees were smashed with sticks or lattes. Their knees were completely crushed and smashed. Next, their faces were pushed against a wall and blows were rained on their backs and bottom till it ripped and bled. They were stripped completely and not even their underwear was spared. They were completely stripped naked and thrown into jail. The gates were locked, but we know for a fact that this is what happened behind the gates. They were taken to a spot where there were no CCTV cameras and steel-tipped wooden lattes or batons or sticks, batons or sticks, were shoved up their buttholes several times. And there was also a great deal of torture and damage inflicted on their genitalia because eyewitnesses of the body have stated they've said that both the genital region and the backside were completely ripped and mangled. Their chest hair was ripped out in tufts. And three times during the course of this entire torture, their clothes, their blood-soaked clothes were sent back to their house and fresh clothes were demanded and those would go back blood-soaked and this happened three times. After a phony trial with a magistrate, this was arranged by the police, uh, the two were taken back into custody and two days later they've been pronounced dead due to heart failure and fever. These were hard-working, lower-middle-class, Tamil-speaking people. You're not. Please tell their story or share this one. Right now, two cops have been suspended and a few have been transferred. That's not the solution and that's not the answer and that is not justice. This case cannot close like this. Please do not let it close. Unless and until we get the same justice George Floyd's murderers did. This was systematic just like...